So, this is what it looks like when your car breaks down in the middle of the road, Nigeria. Yeah, car breaks down in the middle of the road, Nigeria. We're out here too, guys. We are out here, okay? <sighs> yep, things like this happen. But you just roll with the punches, you know? You just roll with the punches. I don't even care. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Get somebody to come pick up the car. Some guy just stopped. We're gonna hop in that car and head somewhere. I was headed somewhere. Don't know if I'm gonna get there today, but we'll see. We shall see. Don't know if we're gonna get there. But things like this happen, you know? Cars break down. So we'll see what happens. You know, every time I come to Nigeria, whether I be on one of those uh, minivans they call buses or in a car, it breaks down. I always have this adventure when I come to Nigeria. But this time I broke down in the middle of nowhere. Check this out. Look at this. I'm in the middle of nowhere. This is like, do you see that? It's the jungle out there, yo. Know? Huh? Huh? We are in the jungle. Straight up. Huh? Look at that. Huh? Whew. Look at that. We're on the road. Yep, might as well get some view. We are walking. They won't let me carry anything. Look at them guys down there. I feel like... Ah, random place. Random people. Hello. Look at These guys are all the way up front. They won't let me carry nothing. I feel, I feel like a... I feel retarded. Because they won't let me carry nothing. This dude's carrying two batteries. Look at it. He's carrying two batteries. The other one's carrying my backpack. And the water he was going to carry. I ain't carrying nothing. I'm carrying nothing, guys. Look, you see, this is my hand. How do I look, huh? Some spoiled American dude. Like, literally, if I tried to grab one of those batteries, he won't let me do it. So, I mean, what, what can I do, huh? Nigerian hospitality at its best. But this place is absolutely beautiful. You know what they say? They give you lemons, you make lemonade. That's what I'm doing now, making lemonade. Apparently we're walking to a bus stop. Yeah, a bus stop. Bus stop. <laughs> I don't, I don't see no buses out here. I don't, I don't see no buses. But we're walking, we are walking. Take you guys with me. You guys rolling with me, huh? Rolling with me. Oh, I think that might be the bus stop. They stopped. Maybe that's it right there. Yep. I just drove on my bike. Look at this. Guys, man. You guys won't let me carry anything. Huh? Is the bus stop? This is the bus. <laughs> ah. All right, we're at the bus stop. Mm. Yo, I disappeared. 
If I disappear, y'all never hear it from me again. Let me, let me give you a reference to my location. <laughs> Here's the sign, yo. Here is the sign. Whatever sign, I don't even know what that, there you go. It says address on here. We can figure it out. Right. That's where we're at. <laughs> Yet again, they won't let me carry nothing. Hands free. All right, hey look, honestly, you guys, I tried, all right? That's my backpack, you won't let me carry it. I, you won't even give me a battery. They just won't let me do nothing. So I can't, you know, can't force it. But we're on the road again. Let's see where we end up. All right, so check it out. This the move, right? You see, I'm covering my head up, right? I'm covering my head up. Because now we gotta get a bus. We gotta get a ride. We're at the, um, we gotta go to the mechanic. We got a few things to do, right? Because we still wanna go to our destination. And one thing about being a foreigner is when they see you, they got they changed the price on you, right? So I came up with the bright idea to hide the dreadlocks. You see, I'm in the countryside and dreadlocks are not very common, right? So it's a dead giveaway, dead giveaway, right? Not that I'm light-skinned because there's plenty of light-skinned people here, but there's not plenty of light-skinned people with dreadlocks. So, so I can keep the price low, I cover my face up. I'm gonna cover my hair, so I put this white on my head. And I cover my face up. Hey, some people wearing masks because they, you know, COVID-19 and all. So this is the move. See, I ain't trying to pay no more than I got to out here. And I'm not trying to make it, so me and my friends gotta pay more to get where we gotta go. All right, let me get it, show you the area of where I'm at right here. We just kinda, we just kinda around, waiting. Waiting to get get this ride. So I'm just chilling. Not deterred. This is just what happens. Just roll with the punches, you know what I mean? You know, honestly, it's this guy's fault. Hey, it's this guy's fault that the car broke down. It's all his fault. If it wasn't for this guy, we would've got to where we needed to go. But for some reason, he broke the car. And now, we gotta do all this extra stuff just to get to our final destination. Hey, what you gotta say for yourself, huh? Nothing. Nothing. Ridiculous. All right, we got ourselves a. We about to get up in the car. Ah, time for our next destination. Let's go.
peoples after uh one broke down car we left that bad boy right on the side of the road took the batteries out and we kept moving we'll go back and get that junk later all right two three cabs later we are here check this out wow ah, look at that look at that huh that is absolutely beautiful we are going to the top of that we are going to the springs and the waterfall at the top of this mountain hill whatever you want to call it we got to climb to the top of that to the top of that it's going down guys all right this is nigeria this place is absolutely beautiful you see this this is absolutely beautiful you don't want to come here <laughs> what this is absolutely beautiful. Now, the only thing I'd say that they need, they need to start doing, Nigeria has so many natural resources. They need to start uh, putting a little bit of money in these places so people can get here. Because we had to like, we had to stop and ask like all sorts of people where this place was. They need to put a little bit of money into these places so that people can have an easier time getting here so it can be promoted more. Because more people will come here if they knew how to get here, if it was easier to get here. And if the signs, you know, you know, signs were like, more pronounced or whatnot so we about to head up to the we're about to get start trekking up the top of this hill mountain whatever you want to call it we're about to go up top <laughs> look at this <laughs>
Okay, done dancing. Let's head up the mountain. Whew, I'm tired. I wore myself out. And I ain't got started on the walk. Goddamn. Whew. Uh, not sure how smart that was, but it was worth it. Uh, oh, the water's already coming. Hey. Let's go. Look at that. Uh. Oh, let's go. Oh, I'm sweating. I'm making the top of this mountain. I don't care how tired I am. Steps are serious. God damn. I'm trying to play it off. Real hard, I'm trying to play it off, but I ain't doing a real good job, man. I don't care. I'm just going to be tired. We're going to get to the top of this. I'm sure I'm going to take me a break. Tell you that right now. <laughs> totally worth it. Dancing. What the hell? You can't tell me what I'm feeling that. Oh. Oh. Look at this. Oh. I want to jump in that. For real. Oh. Whew. All right, I'm thinking this is uh, Taurus Garden, such and such. And I can't even talk, y'all. I can't even talk. Something going on over there. Some ladies behind some things doing something. Huh. I haven't paused this, figure out where we're going. Plus I need to catch my breath. I can't play it off no more. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that view. We haven't even got to the first part yet. I'm catching my second wind. Look at that. Freaking ridiculous. That's so beautiful. You can hear the water. Okay, I see the water. It's the first step. All right, let's go. To the next. Whew, you gotta climb up this. Look at that. This ain't no joke. 
Whew. Look how beautiful it is. That's the camera guy. He'll hit us up for money later. Look at that. Feels great. Look at that. They say my phone is waterproof. Let's go find out. Second stage. Ah. Ah. I really want to get in that water. But I'm not. I got more to go. All right, let's go. Going up the steps. Ooh, let me turn this thing around. These steps are serious. These steps are serious. I can do it though. But uh, you gotta be in shape to do this. I ain't gonna lie. This serious. This is serious. It's supposed to be seven level. We're making it to the second one right now. It's rough. Look at this. Look at this. I'm gonna go ahead and stop this camera. I gotta work on this. Alright. Woo! Alright. Look. We made it. Up these goddamn steps. Look. Alright. The things I'm doing for my subscribers. Alright. Hope y'all appreciate this. Alright. I don't normally ask for money because I don't do that. But my description section, my cash app is right there. Feel free. Okay? Feel free to donate to the channel. Woo! 
Don't get no better than that, y'all. Don't get no better than that. What? Huh? It was worth it. Huh? Look at that. That's amazing, y'all. I want y'all to come out and experience something like this. You know, this is your this is your homeland. This is this is your homeland. This is your this this is a waterfall in your homeland, huh? One of the beauties you can come see. This is your birthright, y'all. This is your birthright. What you mean you don't want to come to Africa? What? Get out of here, man. Hey, if you don't want to come, stay right where you are. There's plenty of people that want to come, y'all. This is amazing, y'all. Look at this. People pay thousands of dollars, hundreds of thousands of dollars to live in places like this. Hundreds of thousands of dollars. So, all right, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed my, my video. It's been a long one. It's a long trip, but it was worth it, all right? So, I hope I inspired you guys to come on out here and enjoy a place like this. Come explore your homeland and your birthright. Huh? Freedom, no racism. Free to be black. Free to be free. Free to enjoy. Nigeria, one of the most beautiful places in the world with some of the most beautiful people in the world, huh? Come on out here, alright? Well, that's all I got for now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. This is Afro Think Tank. Learn something, teach something. I'm out. You're listening to D -D -D DJ DJ Afro Think Tank. Thanks for watching. Like, share, comment, and subscribe.